All right, everybody, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. Let's get right into it. First off, I got to thank everybody that has stuck with me, rolled with me, and all of that stuff, man, because y'all are the real MVPs. But other than that, I got to give a shout out to each and every one of the people that are the gym stars. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, AKA Fresh from the Barbershop, BKA the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video. Hope you're staying, I hope you're staying safe, man. Hope y'all all staying safe, staying uh, from, this, from this horrible disease that is impacted so many of us, man. We can't go outside, we can't do a whole lot of stuff, but y'all already know what time it is, man. I got you. I'm gonna be dropping 2K videos at least once a day, I'm trying to do twice a day this month, man. If y'all continue to support them, I'll continue to drop them, man. Check it out, man. But before we get started, man, look, man, check it out. Bro, I got this for y'all. This is my website, Breeze Tees, link down in the description, man. Look, I've got it to where you can choose whatever you want. Crop your picture, boom, boom, put it on the shirt, bam, boy, look at that thing down, boy, no pain, no gain, that's gonna be the new Donkey Strong shirt that I'm gonna I'm put out, man, and then, look, you can change it, you can change it up, bam, 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 this can be anything that you want, man, so make sure y'all check that out, man, Breeze Tees, link down in the description, man, and uh, if you ordered a shirt from me last week, like I told y'all, man, we got, I had some issues with now I have to get the stuff shipped. I used to be able to walk right into the place, buy the stuff, and when I bought it, I could just I could just press the shirts and send them to y'all, man. Now I gotta order it and it takes a couple of days. So everything's going out today, which is really like in the morning because we already, it's, it's probably gonna be five by the time y'all see this. Anyway, look, man, saying all that to say this, man, 2K is drying up. I don't have a whole lot of stuff to report on, but fortunately they just made my job easy today. We have a new patch out. NBA 2K20 patch 11 has re was released overnight and is now available for download. The patch size was one was is about 4.8 gigabytes because of the, the because of its relatively small download size. Fans shouldn't expect too much too many significant changes uh, to the title. As for as of right now, no official notes have been released by 2K, but there are a couple of things fans have noticed. And then, like uh, what somebody said, man, in spite, in spite of the rumors, the behind-the-back cheese is not back in NBA 2K20. This is probably a good thing, as this move was very OP before a, a before a previous patch nerfed it. Now, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, man. We're gonna talk about that in a second. Also, according to the new, I mean, to uh, users on Reddit, the orange accessories bug in, in, in my team has been fixed. You can now change accessory color to whatever you want. So this is what we got right here, man. Like, uh, let me see, patch, patch 11 fix the uh, orange, uh, but whatever. We don't care about none of that stuff, man. This is what we care about right here, man. NBA 2K patch 11, look, improve the stability of the title in addition to, in, 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 in addition to a number of general improvements uh, to the user experience. Orange bug, orange accessory bug in my team has been fixed. You can now, you can now change accessory color to whatever you want. And the auction house glitch in my team has been fixed by clicking on your collector, uh, your collector level, not confirmed by 2K. Uh, and you know, uh, let me see. We'll update the page if if anything else happened. Pretty much is what they're telling us, man. Look. If that was a glitch in the auction house that people were taking advantage of, brother, you can believe that 2K is not even going to address it. This is what 2K does, man. If it's, if there's a glitch in the game and it was not... If it's something that's game-breaking, right? Like, if it's something that's the, like, like the behind-the-back. If the behind-the-back is in the game, it's not a glitch. They actually put it in their own purpose. They will acknowledge that in the in the, in the the in the whole deal. They'll acknowledge that in their patch notes and they'll say it's fixed. If it's something like the demigod glitch, or if it's something like like that, that glitch right there, they're talking about the auction house glitch or the uh or the orange accessory bug glitch, something that was not intended to be in, in into the game. So if it's an, if it's an exploit, which is something that was meant to be put in the game, but it made the game damn near unplayable, like the behind the back, they will they'll talk about that. They'll say something about that. But if it's something like this, a glitch where something wasn't working because 
of 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 an oversight on their point part they're not going to ever acknowledge it they just fix it and move on and this lack of transparency is what makes people really upset with 2k because when the demigod glitch came out it was like two patches and then they fixed it the behind the back cheese like three or four patches and then they fixed it. Now, I mean, it was like 10 patches, really. But they fixed it. When it was gone, it's gone. A lot of people complained about it. A lot of people cried about it. A lot of people say, if you are not, if, if you couldn't stop it, then you, bro, how you gonna stop something that's unstoppable? Not only was the move overpowered, but you got stunned if they used tight handles, which I don't even know if people even use tight handles like that anymore. If you use tight handles, the move would stun you. And then not only that, but instead of just using the move here and there, you cheesers decided to do it behind screens, which made it utterly impossible to guard. There was absolutely nothing that you could do about it, period. Like if somebody, if somebody was a bum and did it, yeah, of course you're gonna lock it up. If they were even almost decent, it was nothing that you could do about it. There was literally nothing that you could do about a move where I can throw it behind my back and go through you. Or I can go the other way behind my back and go away from you and you get stunned, now I got a free three-pointer. And then you introduce screens to that with how screens were with, man, that's this, this like I said, man, it's crazy. But I'm glad that they, they had the foresight to not bring that back because that would have been something that would have just been game breaking for me and I just wanted to play it. It's almost like the meta in Modern Warfare Warzone, the rockets and driving meta. I mean, and hiding, rockets driving and hiding. That's all you gotta do in that game. It's awful, man. It's almost unplayable to me, but it's all good. Like I said though, if there's a patch, if it's something like that, they'll acknowledge that. They'll say they'll, they 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 took it out of the game and then, you know, uh, unrealistic launches or stuff like that. They'll say stuff like that. But if it's something like, like we said, the Demigod glitch, which took them months to fix, um, or like this, the accessories glitch, uh, you know, the suits glitch, where you could get suits and stuff. You just buy the suits and just walk out, or you just wear it out, and it would just be on you until you change the clothes and stuff like that. Um, the tendencies glitch. All these other glitches that they didn't, things that they didn't put in the game, they'll never say anything about it. Like I said, it's just a lack of transparency on 2K's part that really makes people not even want to play the game or they just get to the point where we just like, bro, it is, this, this is sickening. Nobody cares about that stuff. All you do is get on one day and then you can no longer do it. So you had, like I said, the Tennessee glitch, and then they'll, then people were in the narrative, they started the narrative. People put the, the demigod glitch out there, then they started the narrative that you can't do it in the game. Bro, people were doing it in the game, or they would go do it, go into the wreck, and then come back out. I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy to the point where the Tennessee glitch was in the game, and that was one of the glitches that, I'm more worried about that Tennessee glitch than I was about something else, because I can go look at stuff and tell, you know, okay, this person is blatantly cheating, but somebody could be out there still playing with the tendencies glitch flying right under the radar, and you would never know that he got his player to be able to reach infinitely, but never, but never foul. I mean, he might have his reaching turned all the way up, fouling turned all the way down, dunking turned, like, does he dunk uh, on alleys? Always catches alley, always dunks. Or when he goes to the rim, always dunks, never lays the ball up, stuff like that. Contact dunks is, is through the roof. All of that stuff, man, they, a lot of people glitch their tendencies and then they're still using those players and now they're using them in Pro-Am and stuff like that. And they're still using them and, and it's, it's insane, but then they'll cry about something else, man. But you know, it is what it is. Like I said, 2K dropped the ball in a lot of areas on this game and when they drop the ball, they will never acknowledge that they actually made a mistake. The only thing that they would do is fix it behind the scene, the VC glitches and all this stuff, man. Uh, uh, the VC glitches, they never, they never say they did it. They just drop a patch in the middle of the night and stopped it. The level up glitch, or the badge glitch, they never, they never acknowledged it. The only thing they did was drop a patch in the middle of the night and stopped it. That's all they did. So that's what I'm saying. Like, that could, that could be an infinite number of things in the game that we already know about that they fixed, but we never know the patch that they actually fix it because they never tell us. And like I said, the lack of transparency is something that the community is getting fed up with, I really feel like, and thus, I, I, I don't know if, I don't know how it's gonna end up, man. But hey, it don't matter, man. Let me know if y'all still playing 2K, man. Do you still enjoy the game? I'm still playing it. I'm still enjoying the game. The game is fun to me. 
I think it's cool. I think that they've taken a lot of the cheese out. They've gone a long way. If they could just fix the post stuff. I don't even care about post defense. I'm talking about when somebody pump fakes and I'm standing on the ground and then they just let the dude step through me. Like, he just moves me out of the way. Stuff like that. If, if we can get stuff like that fixed, you know, I'd be cool. But as it stands, I like the game where it is right now, man. I don't got no real problems with it. Been playing with Brute. I probably lost like 10 games on Xbox and won like 150. So you know it is what it is. We're going to be playing tonight. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. That link is down in the description. Please, we're trying to get the 2,000 Instagram followers ASAP, man. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Make sure y'all follow me on Twitter. Make sure you follow me on Twitch. I will be streaming every day during this quarantine, trying to bring y'all some relief. We're going to be doing all this stuff, man. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. God speak. Make sure y'all like the damn video, man. Please. Damn. Peace.